I'm Nadine Wallner, and I'd like to give you a few tips on touring. Anyone thinking of going on a tour should have safety equipment with them. This includes an avalanche transceiver, a probe, a shovel, a first aid package, and an airbag. It's also good if you use a guide for your first trips out, so that you're safe and also familiar with the material. To prepare for your first steps, you attack the climbing skins, open the heel of your ski binding, switch your tour boots to ascent mode, and grab the pole without putting the loop round your wrist. That way, you can quickly and easily let go of the pole in case of an avalanche. Take your first steps on a flat terrain. When touring, it's important that you don't actively lift the skis, but make a sliding motion instead. This saves energy. Here, your arms move counter to your legs. The skis are a hips width apart, and your stride length is adapted to the terrain. On flat ground, the strides are longer, and when things get steeper, they get shorter. So-called step turning then enables you to make your first changes of direction on flat terrain. Here, you lift the ski tip of your inner leg towards the inside of the turn, and then you bring the ski back down on the outside of the turn. For steeper sections, flip the climbing aid of your binding downwards to keep your boot almost horizontal. On steep terrain, your steps will become shorter. You can grab your mountainside pole a little further down to compensate for the slope. If the terrain is steep and step turning is no longer possible, you have to do the switchback. For the switchback, look for a place where you can position the skis almost horizontal and stable. The poles are inserted laterally next to the body. While shifting your weight onto the downhill leg, lift and turn the uphill ski. As soon as the uphill ski is secure, change the position of the poles. Now you shift your weight to the upper leg and turn the second ski to follow you. As soon as you've mastered the switchback, you can do the kick turn. When repositioning your downhill ski, kick against the ski with your heel. That makes the movement even more fluid. If too much snow is sticking to your ski, this kick will loosen at least part of it, making the ski easier to turn. Have fun touring, your Bergfex team.